saw the reactions and you know wait I mean, like, the you saw reactions like on twitter i think or you watch reaction videos because if you watch you might watch including the videos like the oh yes oh my god Click clack to the bang bang. I'm a boy at the bang tank. Me and you, we would never bang bang. I'm a boy at the bang tank. What? Going on, K Squad. We are here today to check out the BTS Billboard Music Awards interview with Zach Sang, the Zach Sang Show. If you guys remember from last time that BTS were in the States, like six or seven months ago, for the American Music Awards, um, Zach Sang was everyone's favorite interview because he asked um, none of those stupid, like, oh, who would you collab with? Who's your celebrity crush? Questions like that that a lot of other uh, companies uh, and, and people asked. Um, asked. He asked about uh, the UNICEF um, project, uh, the BTS UNICEF project, the End Violence project. Um, he asked about a bunch of cool, important, thought provoking things. And, and BTS seemed super comfortable, especially Nam June, because he does most of the talking. He seemed very comfortable with Zach. With, uh, with Zach and uh, everyone was telling me, you, can't, you gotta watch this one, you gotta watch this one, you gotta watch it. And I'm here about to watch it i know that the only thing i know about this interview is that zach has a shirt right and he got bts to sign it and he's auctioning it off and all the proceeds are going to the unicef bts campaign which i think is so awesome so zach thank you so much for that that's amazing you are amazing and how does a bitch bid on that because uh i'm willing to throw a lot of money for that shirt um but uh yeah so let's check out this interview i'm very excited um zach saying bts let's do it let's do this Zach, good to see you. What's up, mate? Shit got loud. Goodbye. Look at him. Hi. What's up, yeah. dude? Oh, Hobie's voice. Let's jump in because uh, Love Yourself Tear, it's a beautiful body of work, man. It is. I listened yesterday while going through a ton of tweets from your fans, and inspired is the wrong way to put it. I mean, I, I, goosebumps, and I, I felt uplifted. Amen. I felt confident, but I also felt true you know i i, I learned more amen from understanding and then looking at the lyric translation oh really fuck know, yeah the records it's beautiful Appreciate it, really. wow zach how, shout out how do you feel now that it's out there into the world and people can enjoy it it's like you saw you know saw the reactions and you know wait I mean, like, the you saw reactions like on twitter i think or you watch reaction videos because if you watch you might watch Including the videos, like the oh! Do it. Okay. All right. Hold on. I don't wanna. I don't wanna confirm. Listen. Obviously, my channel, one of the bigger K-pop channels on YouTube, and I've always thought maybe BTS has seen my videos, and it's a dream to think that maybe they've seen them. Maybe not the fanfic one. No, even the fanfic ones. Like, imagine they. Imagine if like BTS watched one of my fanfic videos. Oh my god! But the fact like I've always hoped maybe they could hear some of my remixes of their songs. At the very least, yeah, watch some of my reaction videos of them. That would be amazing. Uh, Namjoon just said we saw the videos. Uh, that would be freaking amazing if he saw mine. Okay. All right, if all of them saw, I, I, okay, okay. I need to calm down. Imagine, just the fact, that just thinking about the fact that BTS could possibly lay their eyes on me and, like, listen to me talk. Like, these, these dudes that, that I fucking worship. Like, that's just, that, uh, that thought to me is, like, crazy. So, anyway. All the reactions yeah. and tweets and, um, oh my God. I just, you know, like, before it was released, I was kind of, like, worried. I was, like, half and half. Why are you worried? You know, would a miracle come again for us? You know, some sort of things like he loves like, saying things like, are he miracles. He strike twice all the time. You know, yeah, yeah. like so for more, you know, sort of things like that. But afraid, but so for more. That's a really good song, there. And you know, I just like I feel so relieved. And okay, we 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 made this again, and you know. You're only gonna go up. I, I got to know is that you're you only guys going are really up. Personally involved. I mean, you write, you're producing on this yes. album. Yes, sir. I, when you walk into the studio, are you coming clean slate? Do you come with the story that you're ready to tell? <laughs> How does it work? Um, this is a good question. So you know, for uh, for me, um, I I I came to the studio. I like I come to the studio and. Like Sunday, I for a day I, I do nothing for like twelve hours. Okay. I just look at the news and you know sometimes I shopping or sometimes I just listen to other music. Namjoon, so I, cute. I turn the Cubase on. We use Cubase for the program and like 
I, I knew they used Cubase. I, 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 don't I told you guys. Like, push a single like keyboard up the, you know, uh -huh. the piano. But sometimes, a magic happens like in like half an hour, you know, like it just pops out. So like, but you know, the the twelve hours makes the thirty minutes magic. I think. I I yeah, feel I that. I fu hold on. I fucking feel that because I produce. Like I produce music as well. You know, keep when we were looking for a streaming platform. We were looking for something. We An ad popped up. Okay. Uh, like I have a keyboard. Right? I produce my own music. So, uh, I do that too. Like a lot of times, even when I'm writing like like lyrics for English, like uh, for English remixes. Um, it's like I'll just chill and I'll be like ah oh, like and then all of a sudden like maybe I'll be just like banging on my keyboard on my drum pad and like I hear something and I or sometimes I write like one sentence and I'm like oh shit and then you just like go for like 30 minutes like an hour and just like fucking go through it and it's just like ah. Oh! But I understand what he's saying. Not that I'm on the level of BTS, but I understand from uh, an artist standpoint. Or, yes, in those 12 hours, you're connecting with yourself almost. Like the idea yes! of nothing, right, right. when you guys are stimulated so often, you ha there's peace in nothing. Yes, like I exactly. Know, like, I'm, like, I'm relating so hard. Like, and then it comes in a moment. I think that's what Carl, you know, people call ah, it. That's so true. You know, when music pops out. Yes! What have you guys learned about yourself from making and releasing this album? 이 앨범을 만들면서 뭔가 배운 게 있다면 스스로 꼭좀 어, 우리가 앨범을 낼때 되게 장르가 되게 다양하잖아요. 그래서 정글 so cute. 좀 많이 배우는 거 같아요. So you know Zach, they're like You know Zach. <laughs> in our album, right? There could be hip hop, there could be R&B, there could be pop, you know, like sometimes ballad or Latin pop. So Latin pop that while you know through oh yeah uh, singing through singing for this music we learned quite a lot of um like the cultures or the or the attitudes or the you know specific things for the very different genres oh, so yeah. yeah that's what we found i found fuck yeah ourselves. fuck yeah and me too can you define love in your life how would you define love they're gonna say army they're gonna say armies i know these uh, fucking dudes uh, love come on jo <laughs> thank you uh love Love is hope. Love is hope. Love is hope. Oh my god. Yeah. yeah, love could be hope. Yeah. So I was like, yeah, be, love could be hope. Well, <laughs> didn't know. For me, <laughs> just say um, IU. There's really interesting thing between Korean and English language. You know, love and live, right? It sounds really similar. similar. For Korean, in Korean, we call love. In 사랑, we call live, uh, we call we call people in 사랑. So it sounds really similar. So I mean, like love, live, it's the same word. I think. Oh yeah. I'm getting wrapped up. I could talk to you guys for so much longer. Why do you swear? You don't need to scream. Sorry, we don't have um, time. <laughs> I love you, Zach. Yeah, though. dude. I you, I have so much love for you guys. I know. Can I add? I can tell how pissed he is that he doesn't want. <laughs> oh my god, they should. Can they just let him talk for like a half an hour with them? Seriously, he's definitely the best interviewer. By far, clearly they feel the most comfortable. He feels the most comfortable with them. You can tell the true like love that he has for them. Why did you cut it short? I'm mad already. I'm mad. More about, how's yeah. UNICEF going? UNICEF, it's UNICEF. What's going on? It's going really well. And look at yeah, Tay. Look at Jin. Oh, oh, I need to shout the mic in your face. <laughs> <laughs> it's going really well. And uh, for this album, I think we should do for uh, this campaign like one thing more. And we're working for it. Beautiful. Yeah, please stay tuned for UNICEF. So. so my one ask before you guys go is, uh, I got this shirt. It's ridiculous, but uh -huh. I, it, well, no, 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 it's love. Wow. It's love. It is, it's lovable. It is, yeah, it's lovely. Well, will you sign it? And I would like to auction it off and give all the proceeds <laughs> to your UNICEF. Oh, really? Yeah, I would like to for give real? all the money to y like, your organization. Could we? Would we have sign it? Yes. Okay. Fucking king. <laughs> That's amazing. That's fucking sick. That's so sick. I really hope you enjoyed that conversation. If you did, please subscribe and also check out our podcast. There's a link in the description. And also comment and like and do things. Other interviews are on the screen. I will do things as well. So click them. Thanks for watching. Got you, bro. That's so awesome. That is so awesome that they signed and that it's going to be auctioned off. Where the fuck do I find this shirt? And how I want to put all my money into it.
Because seriously, oh my god, that'd be amazing. Um, oh, as I said before, you can tell how much he loves them and, and has a passion for speaking uh, to them about these issues and like things that he's interested in about that he knows armies are interested about. And you can tell how 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 nice it is, how how comfortable Namjoon feels when he talks to him. And I just, it's so awesome. I, I love it so much. I hope that they can have another interview with him and hopefully maybe just like a really long, like where they can actually sit down and chat with him. That would be absolutely amazing because uh, Zach, fantastic interviewer um, and the, the interview itself was, was so much fun. I'm sorry and I'm sad that it was short. He looked very upset that it was cut short. I'm upset that it was cut short. Um, I wish BTS, because we know BTS are very, very busy and they probably had to go somewhere else. But still, hopefully uh, one day they can find time for a longer interview with him because he's a great interviewer and we know how great BTS are and uh, they really seem to really like speaking with him. So uh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for hanging out with me, watching that interview. And uh, I'm just, uh, I'm excited to watch more interviews from them. Hopefully we get cooler interviews uh, just like that one. So I love you guys very much. Have yourselves a super wonderful day. Don't know where my Hangul book is. I found it. So have a lovely day and remember, Yogi Ishunida. Go! Click clack to the bang bang. bang, bang, bang. I'm a boy at the bang tang. Bang, bang. Me and you, we would never bang bang. bang, bang. I'm a boy at the bang tang. Uh, yeah, let me do my thing. my thing. You were never really my friend. My friend. You can't do it, but I can. I can. You were never really my friend. Uh.